This episode of The Tripist is brought to you by J Nelp Innovations. Learn how to make liquid soaps and shower gel easily. Hello everyone, welcome to today's episode on Thetrapist channel. And guess what? Today we talking about Dubai. We bringing you some amazing fact about this beautiful city of the Emirate. You probably didn't know. So stay till the end of the video and learn this amazing fact. As usual my name is Moses Saki AK Bakati and I am the tripist support this channel by subscribing liking and sharing and turn on the bell icon to get notified anytime we post Now let's begin top 10 fact about Dubai you didn't know fact number 1 The Sharjah Mosque is the biggest mosque in the Emirates Located 20 minutes from the Sharjah city, the Sharjah Mosque occupies a whooping 185,806 square meters and can accommodate over 20,000 worshipers. It is believed that the cost of this magnificent structure is around 300 million dirhams. That is around 81 million dollars. 5,000 worshipers within the main hall with allocated seating for 610 women too. Fact number 2. Dubai World Trade Center is the first skyscraper in Dubai. Okay, let's say today you were asked to mention skyscrapers and high-rise buildings in Dubai. You will have tons of them to mention: the Burj Khalifa, Burj Al Arab, and many more. But did you know that few years back Dubai had only one skyscraper? Yes, the first and only skyscraper to be built in Dubai was the Dubai World Trade Center, which was completed in 1979 with 39 stories and 489 feet high. The Sheikh Rashid Tower today, known as Dubai World Trade Center, made history as the region's first financial hub and the major tower. And oh, did you know that Queen Elizabeth II was there to commission and open the center at the launch of the building which marked a new chapter in Dubai's rise to global prominence in trade finance and tourism we see today i hope you enjoying the video so far if you are kindly like subscribe and turn on the bell icon which will help this channel grow thank you fact number 3 the first school to be established in dubai is the al amadiya school Established in a two-story building near the Gold Souk, Al Ahmadiyya School was the first school in Dubai. At the time, the school attracted the finest scientists and scholars from the region and upheld a high standard of education from 1912 until it was finally closed in 1958. It was later renovated and reopened in 1995 as a museum. With each room now offering visitors a glimpse into the past through dioramas and videos, you can find remnants of a beautiful past through intricate design, flow, and furnishings to show visitors how school started in Dubai. Fact number four: Emirates Airline wasn't always around until 1985. Yes, we all know Emirates Airline is one of the biggest, fastest growing, and most reliable flight in the world today. Everyone enjoys flying with Emirates Airlines, but did you know this prestigious airline was only established around 1985? In the year 1984, the ruler of Dubai, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, had a vision for a world-class airline, and with dedication and hard work, by the next year, March 1985, Emirates Airline was born on October 25, 1985. Emirates flew its first routes out of Dubai with just two aircraft, which was leased aircrafts, namely Boeing 737-300. An Airbus 300B4200. The airline now carries more than 50 million passengers per year, with carbon crew from over 150 countries. In 2019, the airline was recognized by the Guinness Book of Records to be the most multicultural flight, with over 145 nationalities on board. Fact number five: Dubai discovered its first oil in 1966. In 1966, oil was discovered in Dubai at offshore Fata field. By 1969, Dubai started oil export. The first export shipment of oil produced from the field Fata was around 180,000 barrels. From then onwards, discoveries after discoveries. Example: By 1973. 
A new oil field is discovered at Rashid and production begins in March 1979. 1982 Another oil field was discovered at Margam etc. It is important to note that Dubai oil refinery costs around 1.5 billion dirhams and produces 120,000 barrels per day and fully owned by the government. As a Ghanaian and African how many of our production and natural resources really belong to us? Do we have enough shares to control it? Share your thought in the comment section let me know. Maybe we can learn why Dubai is far advanced than Africa, so we take the right steps in the right direction too. Fact number 6. Islamic religion was introduced in Dubai and the Emirates in Hay D630. We all know that Dubai and the United Arab Emirates is known to be part of the states with Islam as an official religion and very staunch to the teachings of Islam. But did you know? Islam arrived in the UA after the opening of Mecca. Envoys from Prophet Mohammed P. Buwa arrived in the UA in AD 630 and introduced Islam. Thus, a new era began in the region during the emergence of Islam. Amr bin Alas visited Oman and Sohar and brought the Prophet's message to the kings of Oman, while Abu al alay al-Hadrami visited Bahrain for the same purpose. It is of importance to note that Dubai and the Gulf regions willingly accepted the invitation to Islam. Fact number 7. Before the discovery of oil in Dubai, the region was known for its pearls and fishing industry. Dubai is a giant in the oil industry as we previously discussed, and we talked about how the oil came about. But do you know before the oil was discovered Dubai relied on pearls and fishing? Before oil there was pearlings and fishing, while Dubai had existed as a trading port along important Middle Eastern trade routes since the 1800s, its main industry was pearling. The pearling industry later dried up after the 1930s, while fishing still continued to sustain the region. Fact number 8. Dubai's national flag is red, green, black, and white. But do you know the meaning of the colors? Since Dubai is caving a huge name for itself in tourism and the oil industry, its flag is becoming more popular by the day. But do you know that all the colors has a unique tie to their rich history and the formation of this beautiful region? The red symbolizes the Hashemite dynasty, which is courage, bravery, and unity. White is the Umayyad dynasty meaning cleanliness, honesty, peace, and purity. Green is the Fatimid dynasty which stands for prosperity, hope, joy, and optimism. While the black refers to courage and power, it is of importance to note all four colors also stands for the unity of the Arabian regions. The flag was designed in 1971 by a young Emirati, Abdullah Mohammed al Mayna, who later in his life became ambassador to Czech Republic. Fact number 9. Dubai and the United Arab Emirates was referred to as Trujul State. I bet you didn't know Dubai and the United Arab Emirates was not always called UA. The regions was referred to as the Trujul State centuries ago. Yes, and this is why. Before its recreation as the United Arab Emirate in 1971, the region was known as the Trucial States, a collection of sheikdoms extending from Thestrits of Hormuzdo, the west, along the Persian Gulf. For centuries, the region was mired in rivalries between local emirs on land, while pirates scoured the seas and used the state's shores as their refuge. Britain began attacking pirates to protect its trade with India. That led to British ties with the Trucial States emirs. The ties were formalized in 1820, after Britain offered protection in exchange for exclusivity. The emirs, accepting a truce brokered by Britain, pledged not to cede any land, any powers, or make any treaties with anyone except Britain, hence the name Trujal States. Before I bring you the final fact, please note that this episode is supported by J Milk Innovations. Contact them if you want the best liquid soaps, shower gel, and more. Fact number 10. The official currency of Dubai and the United Arab Emirates is dirhams. I guess it no news that with current rise of Dubai and the United Arab Emirates, a currency is becoming more popular by the day, but I bet you didn't know. The Emirati dirhams, which is mostly abbreviated as EED, the name originates from the Greek drachma, literally means handful, which was the 
Greek currency used dating back as far as 2,500 years ago. The currency was introduced in circulation for the first time on May 19, 1973. The first Durham notes, introduced in 1973, were in denominations of aid 1, 5, 10, 50, and 100. Three years later, the aid 1000 note was released. And oh, since you have stayed from beginning till the end let me give you one bonus fact about the currency. The United Arab Emirates national currency carries the name and emblem of the UA. Hence, the moral value is greater than its material value. Hence, in the UA, it is a crime to mishandle, counterfeit, tear, or misuse the currency in a malicious way. Offenders shall be arrested punished by a fine of 1,000 dirham or 10 times the value of the mutilated, destroyed, or torn currency, whichever is higher. Thanks for watching. See you next time.